right, Technical Wizard here, and if you haven't seen the Roomies video yet, it's up finally, but I don't think I'm going to be doing any more of those because it took me, uh, my, it took me four, it's a four hour video, it took me 12 hours to upload it and three to export it, so I can't do that anymore because it took too, way too long, and I've got personal things to do in my life, so sorry about that. Aoi Mizusaw was the only route y'all are going to see unless I actually record them in secret and upload them later on. But anyways, on with today's video. Today's video is going to be featuring my beloved Gateway E4200. Y'all already know the computer. You know it. You love it. Pentium 3 Windows XP from my elementary school. But I did a thing to it that will probably make it usable for a while. For a little longer at least. But I'm going to go ahead and pull the side off of it. I'm used to seeing this computer taken apart now, which I always have been anyways, but you'll notice the Ethernet card sitting on top of here. I've never in my life used it. It's the OEM Gateway one that came with it when it was new. I think I pulled it out of the Gateway Essentials sitting right over there. But you can see there's a little antenna sitting right there. And if you look into the computer, oh, this is kind of hard. You can see I put a, this is kind of hard to show it, but you can see a Netgear wireless card. So the E4200 has Wi-Fi now, and I don't have to stick this thing into it anymore. Speaking of which, I'll just sit it on the Desk Pro over here, because I use it sometimes. But we'll go ahead and power up this bad boy. It's been a while since I've actually used this computer. And other than the Wi-Fi card, it's the same specs as it used to be. Pull them up. Uh, 256 megabytes of RAM. Actually, I may have taken a piece of RAM out of it. I don't know. And this monitor's still chugging along, surprisingly. As well as the floppy drive, I figured it would have broke by now because this thing's went through more floppy drives than I can count, and I barely even use them. <laughs> the only time I use a floppy drive on this thing is when I transfer files to the Desk Pro or another older computer. Hey, for example, the Presario 2200 chilling right over there. I should make some more videos on those, but most of those computers haven't been touched in a while due to my lack of time. Because I have a job now. Go ahead and log in. Pull up a chair. And here's the little Netgear utility. Go ahead and pull it up. And as you can see, it's hooked to my hotspot. Neat. Alright, maybe not. Scanning. Okay, there we go. Okay, it's blinking. There is what we were waiting for. Alright, cool. Close it. We'll go ahead and open Firefox. Which, I don't know how much longer this browser is even going to last. Because it is almost completely dead on this computer. I can barely pull up YouTube anymore. And I can pull up Google Drive, surprisingly, which is really hilarious because I typed an entire essay on this thing earlier this year. But it pulls up um, Firefox. Let's go ahead and look up my channel. I don't know what that website is, but I am literally the second thing on Google, which is hilarious. Never thought I'd make it that far. But anyways, yeah. Let's see, what else? What else? You know what, let's just go ahead and open Renlearn. <laughs> go ahead and take a trip down Nostalgia Lane, or Memory Lane, or whatever you want to call it. Same difference.
Look at that old hard drive. Hey, it's actually opening. Okay. It's doing it through Firefox, though. Sorry for the flickering camera. It won't focus. Oof, I haven't been on this in a million years. Go ahead and type my stuff in. Alright, so I opened Renlearn. I don't have anything on here anymore. Which is... I can't even look through my stuff that used to be on here, but... Whatever. Home. Okay, it's blinking. You do not have any products. Oh well. Good while it lasted. Alright, so... Let's see. It's got all kinds of stuff on here. I would try the internet games, but we all know that they're gone. Like internet checkers. Play. It won't hook up, so. We're in the end game, folks. We shop channels closed. The Microsoft games are gone. Next is Adobe Flash Player. But, yeah, enough of that computer. So, before I end the video, I'm just going to go ahead and point out that if I've never shown it, then this is my little Dell Optiplex. It has Chrome OS on it. Blech. I just use it to archive school stuff, but it's dead. <laughs> oh, poor computer. Anyways, just go ahead and cut it off. All right, so I hope you all enjoyed this video. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more. Hit the bell so you won't miss a video, and I'll be seeing y'all later.